coming. Oh my god. <laughs> Hi guys, welcome back to my vlog. Today is July 30, 2023, and I'm here with Jebby and Cindy. And we will be riding in this boat here. This boat will be leaving at 1 o'clock. Yeah. And this is our ticket, so we have to present this when boarding. So it's $16 per adult. This is my first time here. My first time as well. Uh, <laughs> because your first, is this your first time? Fourth time. Uh, oh! oh. <laughs> wow! So this is the surroundings. So this boat will be going to that section over there. I'll show you later. And you can see it doing a Experience show Experience the beauty now. of Lake Marine from the water. Boat tours run every weekend from 10 a.m., 11 a.m., 12 p.m., and Ooh, 1 p.m. It's a 30-minute cruise. Come, enjoy the this serenity. area. It's on top of the boat. <laughs> and it belongs to me. <laughs> <laughs> Hang on, there are any crocodiles in here? We'll find out when we all end up in the water. <laughs> That's what we'll be doing soon. <laughs> we'll be walking on water, I'm going to show you with that. Hello. Quack, quack. I'm not going to drop it. You know the rules. Wait, what is it? This cruise boat is available to book. They offer customized services for special occasions and events. They cater everything from corporate to social events, wedding ceremonies, receptions, baptisms, baby showers, birthdays, anniversaries, and more. It's my first boat cruising here on Lake Barin. So enjoy the scenery, guys. Uh, we did have a free dive and go down. which became inundated with water. 
And when the water and the magma came into contact, all the heat pressure blew out the central core, and this all happened under the Earth's crust. So you're left with a big crater full of rainwater. And the little crater to the left was caused by an after explosion. It's about 25 meters down at the bottom. And you can see a little clearing going through the trees there. Yeah. That's our overflow. Oh. Uh -huh. like the eels migrate through. So if we get too wow. much water, it will run out there, all the way down to the ocean. So this lake does stay at a constant level. I am going in here because I did spot a couple of pythons in here. And now from July to the end of September is their breeding season. What uh, month did you spot them? You know, they have the steam python. Oh, okay. More commonly the scrub python. Oh dear. And they were mating. Somebody said, how do you know they're mating? I said, it's like smoking a cigarette. <laughs> <laughs> No, you can tell. The difference between two pythons going, wrapping around each other is they're fighting. When okay. they're mating, they're totally still, they're apart except for the tail ends connected. But um, they might be under the reeds or they might have come back up on top. We'll go and have a look. This python is not going to the boat, is it? <laughs> um, there is always a possibility that are caring. There, look it. It's black. Oh my god, that's scary. I don't know, I believe you. I can't see. I'm joking. <laughs> there. Do you want me to get that point? Yes! <laughs> <laughs> That'd be an idea. <laughs> oh my god. Just go over and point to it. Oh dear. feeding the turtles down there with the eels and stuff. Yeah. So how old are these? My arm's open. My 
Dennis. Normally we do feed, feed them crack corn. We we only do the boats on the weekend. Folks, none of them are tree roots that you see under the water. They're all trees that have fallen in over the years. Uh, they're all trees that have fallen in over the years. Wow, that's a pretty picture. It's beautiful because a lot of the trees do drop down. Yeah. It's like this one on the corner. And it is eventually going to fall in. They do break down quite rapidly above the waterline. Yeah, beautiful uh, red flower on the umbrella tree. Great ornamental plants. <laughs> and during the war, it's been a convalescence home for the Australian Army. There's over 200 soldiers here, some recovering from the malaria. It's also been a boarding school in Mario's Brothers. And it's also been a guest house. Today it's originally back at the tea house, but there's a difference. Today it's still in the family and it is freehold. So the Curry family owns everything on that one acre and the tea house and of course it's both. So if you visit Atherton Tablelands here in far north Queensland, make sure this will be one of your list. All right, thanks, Cindy. Hey. Hi, guys. Snapshot of the day. Enjoy. guys it looks like it's the end of our tour thank you so much for watching and see you in my next vlog and thank you to our beautiful captain today here at the lake burning boat too bye